what's up guys you're welcome to our channel an interesting topic comes your way anambara community ejects headsmen cattle over destruction of farms if you're new on this platform just hit the red button down the video subscribe and be updated indigenous of obaru community in anambara state have injected headsmen and their cattle from entire local government area over destruction of farms tens of thousands of cattle are being shepherded out of the local government by their owners this incident was confirmed by community chairman of local government mr arinze awogo though awogo said the herdsmen and their cattle were yet to leave the community he said discussions are ongoing for a peaceful exit of all henchmen and cattle from Obaru owing to the atrocity they committed against the people. He said the exit of the henchmen and their cattle has been suspended until 12 a.m. on Sunday to ensure that their movement does not cause a traffic gridlock. A letter by Awogo, which he wrote to stakeholders in local government and which he also made available for public reading, stated, May I start by appreciating our community leaders, Ndiyugwe, the PGs, the women leaders, the youth leaders, the vigilantes, our political leaders, an average farmer and the Obaru public for the maturity in handling the invention of cattle and herders in our barrow and in our farm space. We agree that no one means of livelihood will be subjected to mindless destruction and pillaging and will listen to the voice of reasoning, but you did. I must commend you and also for your patience and understanding thus far. However, we have in the past days made agreeable progress in line with our avowed pursuit of a negotiated exit of cattle and herders from our space, and I can assure you that the process of peaceful exit has been concluded. The herders will begin their peaceful movement by midnight today and will require free passage to exit. I wish to appeal to our people, particularly those around Osomala, Umonangwa, Oba, Obakuba, and Ochiche Umwadu Axis to allow the headers up till midnight to quickly and quietly leave, as any movement in daytime may cause much difficulties both to the headers and to traffic, given the number of cattle involved. The law on anti-opening grazing is clear and Obaro won't accept anything to the contrary. On this note, guys, what's your opinion? As Anambara states, particularly Obaro local government, have risen up to eject headers, Fulani headers, and their cattle out of their land. Well, put down the comment. Comment down the comment box. Tell us your opinion about this and stay tuned.